Okay, I was whipping with my golden goby because I was thinking I can get a hawkfish, but on my first cast, I got something. There it is. Oh my God, it's a grouper. Small grouper. My first cast, wow. Look at that. He loves that golden goby, huh? Oh well. Check this out, he had a baby fish in his mouth. Wow, let's see if I can get it out. Hold on. Yep, there it is. Took it out of his mouth. You know, these are invasive species, but they say you should just kill it. Hey guys, this is known as Cephalopholus argus, the uh, Roy grouper as it's known here locally in Hawaii. They get up to 20 inches, they're fairly big. And the common name is either peacock grouper or blue spotted grouper. Now, when I was down in Tahiti, um, going to East Island, this is a very popular food fish. You know, they average around, I guess, eight to twelve dollars a pound. All right. So back in the fifties, uh, here in Hawaii, um, the legislature, in their almighty wisdom, figured they would help the Hawaii. Uh, fish market and you bring in some of these fish from the Marquesas along with some other um, type of fish which are blue line snappers to api and black fin snappers which are toao okay instead of uh, another cash fish for Hawaii they, it was a disaster these things are so aggressive they started to eat all the young of our um, more um, expensive fish like the kumus and the vekiulas which are all gold fishes and the studies have shown that eat the young of other reef fish and it's been decimating the reefs since um, the legislature brought them in in the late 50s in several large shipments. So that's what happens when you fool around with mother nature. Also, it was later found out that the roy was very high in secret toxin. Uh, so because of this side really effect of the bad, secret toxin, uh, it made this of, fish virtually uh, unusable here. Affects but people you know, it, it does people. taste good. Um, I've had ciguatoxin from Jack's, but not from the grouper, but it is a tasty fish. It's still sold here in Hawaii. Down in Chinatown, I just saw it recently going for $20, $18, $20 a pound. So, you know, you cannot change the way people think. Um, people still want to take a chance of eating it, but this fish is destroying our local fish stocks of uh, desirable species. That's the best way to put it. So um, thanks to introductions like this, it's... It, it's bad for any any location when you introduce something that is unknown. Okay, so thanks for listening and watching. Thank you.